Veers. Um, just a little update. I know that some of the videos I've been posting has been a little on the lame side. I know that. It was, uh, I was kind of stretching the videos out because when we got back, because of uh, a couple of medical issues here, I didn't get a chance to take off and do what I thought I was going to do. The idea was when we got back from uh, <clears throat> our last stop, which was at that campground at Macon, Georgia, if you remember right, I was going to hit, for the next couple of weeks anyway, I was going to go to the different campgrounds around Florida, and I hadn't picked any of them out yet either, by the way, that were along the beach. I didn't know where they were all at. I knew they had them, though, and I was going to go and video the area, get the information for you, prices, that kind of thing. But like I said, we didn't, uh, we couldn't do it uh, for reasons beyond our control. I just want to let you know that uh, we're getting close to that thousand number. And once I get to that thousand number, then I can start doing some live stuff too. Until then, I can't. And I haven't checked, but Sue was telling me yesterday, she said we were getting close to a thousand. So hang in there, keep subscribing. And then when we uh, take off for Texas, the last of February, I can't, I don't know the exact date, but I'm going to say it's around the 25th, 26th is when I'm figuring on starting to head over there. Uh, I'm going to do my last Wednesday live show on my Villages channel. I'm going to hang around here for that. And then hopefully we got everything sitting here, loaded up, ready to go, gassed up. And then next morning, pack up our stuff that we have to pack up that's left. There won't be that much, if any. And because we've done this before. And we'll just get in it and start it up and take off. I'm going to do a lot of video along the way. Hopefully I get my dash uh, camera set up where it's decent. Those are kind of tricky sometimes. Exactly where to put them, how to put them to get the, the best road video and things like that. So I'm going to do my best and then um, hopefully I have Wi-Fi here and there and we're going to uh, start downloading stuff. I'll be in Texas for a month at a uh, recreational um, resort down there. Never been there. I don't know anything about the place. It's in Rockport, Texas. My cousin is there. He told me it was a really nice place. But I'm not there just for the resort. I'm there to check out Rockport. I did Google some things around Rockport. There's a lot of campgrounds around there. Uh, there's a lot of them around the area. If uh, yeah, I don't know where they're all at, but I'm going to check a few of them out, I think, for you. Take some video. And I'm there to uh, enjoy some of the activities. I don't know what all the activities are. I just know that my cousin said that they take a ferry ride once in a while to go to some island somewhere. They go turtle watching. I don't know where that is or what it is. They go someplace to uh, watch the dolphins and just different things like that. And so I'll be videoing some of those things. And I'll also let you know how much the campground is going to cost me for the month. I know the, the longer you rent a spot, the cheaper it is. So I'll try to get the prices for you where I'm at anyway, what it would cost by the day or the week. And I'll, I'll know what it costs by the month because that's what I'm paying. And um, yeah, you know, I'll do some video showing you maybe some interesting things that we're doing there and how we're doing it. So yeah, we're going to get some video out there. It's just going to take me a little while because we're still here. Uh, I can't leave until after Sue has her uh, final treatment. And then her next treatment is like April 2nd or 3rd or 4th or something like that. And I don't know how we're going to handle that yet. I don't know if we're going to fly her back to get it done or haul ass back here to get I don't know we'll have to worry about that like she was working on it she was wanting to get it done there and have the medicine flown there I'll just have to let you know because I don't know oh by the way for those of you that don't follow me on the villages channel beer of the day yingling lager 
So, I'll be a lot, some other videos in Texas too. Some of the food, uh, some of the different beers, if they have something different that uh, I might be interested in. Let you know about uh, how the uh, camper's doing, gas mileage wise. Remember, my video is not for those that are wanting to do it full time. Sue and I has never figured on doing this full time and uh, we're not going to do it full time. I am what you might want to call a weekender, uh, but we don't just weekend. Generally speaking, when we take off in a camper, we're going from four to eight weeks at a time. Last time we went out, we were gone for, I believe it was five weeks and we come home for a month or two then take off. It's all got to work around her treatments. We got to get them done. And she gets them every six weeks. So that's the time frame we have to work on. I'll uh, keep you informed of what's going on and how we're doing it. And I'm just putting this one up to have a video actually for this week or next week. I've just been doing one a week. When I'm on the road and, I'm, and uh, doing some things, I'm going to try to bump those up to two and three uh, videos a week. Uh, as long as I got some interesting stuff to put on there. If not, then it'll just be once a week. Because I just don't want to put up, you know, the same old, same old that everybody else is doing. And because I watch a lot of videos too. So I'll try to find something interesting, something maybe different. I'm not sure how different it's going to be because if you're in an RV, I mean, it is what it is. You drive, you can. That's what it is. So anyway, I'll get out of here. Uh, keep watching. We're close to that 1,000 mark, and I will do some live. I think those are interesting for everybody. You can ask questions. If you guys has got anything interesting along the way, I do think I'm going to be spending the night at a place called, I want to say, I don't have my phone here, Richard, Richard Dale, I think that's what it is, Richard Dale, Alabama. There's a camper's world there, and they have uh, free hookups, and free camping for overnight, one one night, if you're a SAMS member, and I am. From here to there, though, like 400 and some miles. And I don't know what time you got to be there. I got to call them. I'm not sure if I'm going to get there on time. Depends on what time I leave here. See what I'm getting at. It's all, it's all about timing. But anyway, if I, if I do leave here early enough where I can make that, I'm figuring on staying there because it's free. And it's full hookup, they told me. Um... Electric, sewage, water. It was all right there. And while I'm there, because I'm down to about a quarter tank of LP, I think, I think I'll just go ahead and fill up my LP while I'm there, too. So, anyway, I'm going to get out of here. And hopefully, I'll see you guys uh, this next month or the end of this month or starting next month on some videos. And uh, got any comments, any suggestions below along the way? My, I know my route is going to be 10 over to at least Houston, Texas, and from there, I don't know, uh, to get down to Rockport, I don't know what the best uh, trail is to follow. We'll see when we get there, I guess. So, like I say, if you got any suggestions or anything like that along the way, put them in the comments below. I read every one of them because um, it helps. So I'll see you guys on the other side.